What's up wrestlers? Tom Tannis with C2X uh, coming today with a front headlock series. Uh, front headlock was our bread and butter. Um, we call it the Jefferson Special back in the day uh, because it was so effective. Uh, but we're gonna go over just the front headlock and getting into different finishes from that. So the, the main thing that we wanna know with front headlocks is position. Everything is about position with the front headlock. So when we snap them down and we get into our front headlock, I never clasp my hands with a front headlock. I keep my shoulder in his neck and I keep his head underneath my chest. Once that head pops out either side, I'm in trouble. So shoulder's in here, hand is cupped on the chin, and I'm gonna keep my elbow pushed in on his head so he can't escape. My other hand is gonna rotate around his arm as far as it can. I'm gonna pull up, rotate back, so now it kind of weakens that arm. And then I'm gonna push this arm right against his ear, okay? I'm gonna use my ear to kind of block this arm from being able to move as I start to work. So the first one we're doing is just a little hip heist, chasing the near leg. So I have my ear against his shoulder. I'm putting all my pressure on him. And I'm gonna go into my hip heist. The head follows with me. So I pop down through, I never touch my hips. And now I'm gonna hip heist back over and I'm gonna chase this leg. I wanna grab the ankle if I can. So I drive over to here, get the ankle. I'm gonna be lifting as I pull the head in this direction and I'm gonna circle, hopefully putting him on his back. Nice and tight with that chin hand, it never leaves. And you put him right on his back. Shoulder in, right to here. All my pressure's on him. Elbow stays in, wrap around his arm, pull up. Get my head to block his arm. Hip heist hard, bring the head through. Never touching. Step back over, lift up, put him on his back. Post right there. Front headlock, hip ice, chase the leg right to his back.